Hi guys, so I have been using this chiller for around 5 years so I guess it is time now to have a backup chiller just in case anything happened to my old chiller. But before that, let's hear how noisy the chiller is. So this is the noise that the chiller will produce when it's um, chilling the water from my tank. So as you can probably hear, uh, the noise is bearable. Now let's have a look at the new chiller which I have bought. So the new Hylia HP1000 chiller is a 1 horsepower chiller. So this uh, new chiller has a turbo function which lets you quickly chill your tank water. To be honest, I went for the highest powered chiller so uh, to save any trouble in the future just in case I want to upgrade my tank or add any tank. And the chiller is supposed to have a reliable and quiet operation. So they have upgraded the panel for the new Hylia series chiller. To use the chiller is pretty much uh, self-explanatory, you just hit the set button then you can press the up or down button to raise or lower the temperature of your tank. You can also use the turbo function to enable quick chilling on your tank. As for the input and output, uh, you will need to pump water into the input and the output will be the chilled water from the chiller. To save my pump usage, I will be using my return pump and the output from the chiller will be going back to my main tank. So after you have moved the chiller, it is best to leave the chiller overnight uh, to prevent any damage on the chiller. So the first impression on this chiller is it is really noisy. So if you're thinking to put the chiller in your living room, uh, this thing sounds just like a washing machine. So I will be setting the chiller to around 27 degrees Celsius. So this is how the chiller sounds like when it's in the chilling process. So the chiller is functioning pretty well. I'm able to reduce uh, the temperature of my 500 liters tank from uh, 28 Celsius to 27 Celsius in around uh, 30 minutes. The only thing you should be aware is the noise that is caused by the chiller. So if you're putting this in your living room, it may sound like a washing machine so you should be aware of it and the thing may cause uh, a lot of heat so I may shift the chiller into a semi-outdoor environment in the future. 